Hello Aquarius and welcome to your weekly gemstone and moonstone readings. Um, I'm just going to do the theme of the week. I said that last week. But I will be doing um, next week the monthly for uh, uh, monthly reading for the month of October with the gemstone and moonstones. So let's see what wants to come out for you guys. I'll put some in there. Okay. These are the ones that wanted to come out for you guys. Let's see where they want to fall. Oh, wow. Oh, I like that, that this stone. This is a beautiful stone. And this is coming in, but I'm going to put it here. Okay, I always read the runes first. And so you have this rune here, and the other rune is in reverse. This rune is saying there is some, um, it's like a tower effect. There is some necessary change that is coming in, and it's coming into action probably this week. And it's leading, I think it's a good, you know, it's, it's necessary change. So there is some disruption. Um, energies are turning and there is um this is with these stones together there's wish fulfillment coming in and things being revealed things coming out so um that is good and it's like letting letting go of some things uh, getting rid of some stuff and there is love looking like it's coming in and it's, for some of you, it could be almost like a soulmate. That's another possibility. But anyway, that is the theme here. So, and this rune did come into reverse. And this rune is, I'm um, talking about intuition, um, inspiration, and knowledge. So it's coming in. So there are still things that um, you are trying to clear out. Troops are coming in. Things are yeah, taking a little bit, but things are definitely, you know, this rune is coming in and changing this all up. So, um, go with your intuition. Um, you guys are going to be inspired and you may, may be starting, you know, it's like you're going to be doing maybe some different stuff here. It's like new ideas coming in, um, new ways to handle situations. It's like, you know, you're weeding things off and you're going to be moving around. I mean, these are really good stones. You got some very good stones here and you're gaining some knowledge at the same time. And this, you know, with all this coming in, there could be money even coming in later on. Because it's connected to again job whoops job home that's a yes job home and um wish fulfillment so you get some good stuff coming in but there's definitely like a love here for some of you now of course if you if you're in a partnership already and then this just could mean there's a, some change and reconnecting again i do have to say that some of you have made, made a decision to um um get divorced um, or move out, leave, because there is some kind of change here too. So that is depends on who, you know, who we're talking about here because it's, it's really hitting the emotional side here and there's change definitely going on, doing something you wanted to do, clearing out things, things coming out, troops being revealed, wishes, um, being fulfilled. And it's going to take a little bit because this stone here that flew out that I said was beautiful. This is again, love stone and a lot of changes and gaining knowledge it's like you're stronger for love you're um you you're at the point where you know what your standards are and if they were maybe too high or if they weren't fair you changed everything around you worked on yourself too because you got some great energy coming in here too so and i do see um some it could be a soulmate coming in so i mean these are things that are really good. And these could be things that really matter to you or doing things that you love. Maybe new things, new ideas are, are, could be coming in. You could be hearing advice from some people, gaining some um, insights like, hey, that's something I've always wanted to do. Thanks for the idea and that you may be doing some new stuff. So it's all coming in. It's um, breaking down like, you know, the whole work, um, the um, your tangible goods, your emotional side. These are things that are taking into action. So it's really looking so much better here. I really do like it. And you know, let's pull a card for you guys. Oops. <laughs> Two 
cards fell out. You know, that happened for a few signs already, too. So let's read those two cards anyway, because they did fall out. Okay, so it says, the first one says, um, let it go. So that's what you're doing here. It's like you're, there is necessary change coming in, and you're definitely letting things go. So it's you're clearing things up because you're just like in this, um, mindset to really please yourself or do things that are really good for you. And the other one says twin flame. There we go. So there is like possibly a love coming in, um, and a twin flame. Now twin flames, they usually have lessons to learn from each other too and gain some knowledge. They're, they're there for a life purpose too. So they usually, um, what's lacking in your life, they are there. It's like uh, vice versa your strengths is um his weaknesses or hers and vice versa and then you you balance each other out and you learn lessons from each other so that's that's great um i like these two anyway aquarius that is your reading for the week of uh, september 26th please like share and subscribe and catch you tomorrow for my coffee cup readings bye guys